how does it feel to be back? Chuck Chambers is back. I knew that's Chuck. Chuck is evil. It's your boy Guppy from my Carly. Happy birthday. I play Lubert. Hot biscuits. It's season two. Fun, huh? <laughs> Last season, one of the best things that we did on the show was bring back as many people as possible. Uh, friends, enemies, frenemies. We're continuing that this season. We have probably more enemies than friends at this point. Hey! I know a lot of people want to see the Spencer-Chuck rivalry. Is he your son? Yeah. Well, he's been playing racquetball in here even though I keep telling him to knock it off. That's it. You're grounded. Yeah! Ah! Hey! Every time you see Chuck, he's just always around Spencer. And now he's on a vendetta against Spencer all the time, forever. Years later, we're back, and he's trying to get back at him again. Get him out of here! I think Chuck has changed a lot since the last series. Physically, Chuck hit the weights uh, just for many years to get that one moment where he can get back at Spencer somehow. In your room. Chuck was a big part of my childhood. I wasn't even a teenager yet doing those episodes. There's always a little piece of Chuck with me, and the fans of the show make sure that I know that. I caught the thief. Well, who is it? I'll tell you who it is. <laughs> it's me! <laughs> what? what? We have so many guest stars from the original iCarly pulling up on us, and you know, some you might remember as uh, people who, I don't know, worked with doors. <laughs> Pretty big, right? Yeah, I don't know, who could that be? A very distinct scream, I don't know. We just had Lubert on the show, Jeremy Rowley, and we did a whole episode with him that was so much fun. Lubert is back, played by Jeremy Rowley, he's hilarious. One of my fond memories from the previous run is watching Jerry's hair go short and long, and short and long, and now it's like middle. I've been laughing all week working with him. It was awesome getting to see him again, and getting to see them put that wart on. You'd be surprised how much the beard and the wart make me look a little different. My son is hurt! What's wrong with you? Uh, For one thing, I got a wart that needs cream on it! Uh, you put cream on my... <gasps> oh, I can't even say it. Your wart? My character has spent years and years developing a new suave, playing a long game to get those kids. I want the money! And I want ownership of iCarly. <gasps> it was also really cool getting to see Ethan, uh, who plays Guppy on the show. Hi, Guppy! <laughs> when he used to be on the show, he was six, and now he is 18, and he's six foot five. <laughs> So when we did the old show, he was so tiny next to me, and now I have to like look way up in the sky to talk to him. My pants are too tight. I am now taller than all the cast members, so it's funny coming into set seeing Jerry, who plays Spencer, and I used to be like at his legs, and now I'm the same height as him. So that's exciting. Now I can fight. No, I'm Is it anyone's birthday? Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Ah, oh, jeez. It feels almost like I'm just transported back in time and I'm back on set as Guppy on our car. It's awesome. Boo! Oh. Also, uh, maybe some people who weren't exactly on this show, not iCarly, but who were fan favorites of other Nickelodeon shows, they might be making an appearance or two. Hug me forever! You know, over the last decade, I have grown a little bit. I've become like a real man, perhaps. I'm at least the height and weight of a full grown man. I did not tell her to say that. Oh man, to be working with Miranda again is a dream. I just love her. It's surreal for me to see her. Now, I think she's 28 years old. I mean, I met her when she was eight. Your punishment is that your little stunt actually helped us. Ha ha. <laughs> well, tomorrow's another day. Yeah, I remember when she was talking to me about doing the iCarly reboot, I told her like, well, when the right part comes along, I'd love to come and play and just sort of have fun for a couple episodes. And so I'm so glad that it got to be this part on this episode. I'm sorry, but I cannot work with this guy, okay? It's either him or me. Oh, that's exactly what a chicken would say. A lot of really interesting things are happening for Freddy this season. His relationship with his mom is going to change in this season. You didn't sign the shampoo agreement. How do I know if you double pooed? <laughs> 
You thought I was kidding. Mrs. Benson is even more knowledgeable about how someone should eat. When a big boy eats his vegetables. Don't sing the song! What they should wear. No, we're not renting bowling shoes. Because I refuse to put my feet in public footwear. And um, just general uptightedness. And I hope that never goes away. Thank you, Mrs. Benson, for that case-shattering testimony. We've got Melissa Joan Hart is directing episodes. Like, this is season two. Season two, guys. And Kat, season two. I Carly is going back more so to its roots, I feel like. Everybody has just grown up, and I think that's the beauty of iCarly returning on Paramount+. Plus. You get to have a whole new storyline, as well as some familiar stuff from the original series, so it's all new and fun. Unka, Unza. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. What? Oh, okay. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Ha, ha, ha.